It is a great, great honor uh, to have Mr. Kichu Yoshida and Ms. Mariko Okada here with us today. Uh, my name is Daisuke Mayo. Uh, I'm a professor and Hajime Mori chair in Japanese language and literature at UCSD. Mr. Kichu Yoshida, he is one of the most important filmmakers in the history of Japanese filmmaking. Uh, making his directorial debut in uh, 1960 uh, with a film called Rokudenashi or Good for Nothing. Um, he became um, a central figure of the so-called Shochiku New Wave or the Japanese New Wave. And um, he um, became independent in 1964 and he made a number of critically acclaimed films. Uh, he um, has made 19 feature films and more than 100 90, I guess, uh, documentary films um, to this day. Um, Ms. Uh, Okada, Ms. Mariko Okada, she's one of the most beloved um, stars and actresses in the history of filmmaking in Japan. She made her um, acting uh, debut in 1951 uh, with a film called uh, Mai Hime, or The Dancing Girl, uh, directed by a master filmmaker, uh, Mikio Naruse. And uh, after that, she worked with a number of um, famous and uh, talented filmmakers, um, Yasujiro Uzu, uh, Kon Ichikawa, uh, Juzo Itami, and so on and so forth. Um, in order to, uh, and then uh, she made her debut at one of the major studios in Japan, Toho. Then she moved to another major studio in Japan, uh, Shochiku, uh, in the 1960s. And she produced a film that commemorated her 100th uh, appearances on the screen. The film was called Akitsu Onsen, Akitsu Hot Spring. And the film was directed by none other than Mr. Kiju Yoshida. So that was the beginning of their very fruitful, uh, very prolific um, careers together. And um, they made uh, 11 films to, uh, together in total. And, uh, and tonight, um, you are going to watch a film called Coup d'etat, uh, which was made in 1973. It's one of the, uh, I can't say one of the, this is a very beautifully made and fairly politically acute film. So um, without further ado, I would like to uh, introduce, I would like, uh, please join me to welcome Mr. Kiju Yoshida and Ms. Mariko Kan. これから、ね、用意いたします。会の、ま、私が the film you are about to see, uh, Coup d'etat or The Martial Law, uh, is uh, one of the so called trilogy of Kichu Yoshida's political films or films about politics. Uh, even though this term, the films of politics, uh, was not named by myself, uh, the critics named these three films the Kichu Yoshida's political films. The first one of the quote unquote trilogy, trilogy is Eros Plus Massacre, the film that was screened here yesterday. Eros Plus Massacre, yesterday's film, depicted a massacre which occurred uh, 10 years before I was born. Uh, my grandfather knew about the massacre. Uh, the film you are about to see, Kureta, 
is about an incident, actually, the martial law which uh, occurred or which um, was uh, ordered in Japan only once in, the long, in its long history. Um, so the film is about this martial law. Uh, and this incident occurred when I was just three years old. Since I was only three years old, I don't remember anything about this incident. However, um, my father, um, uh, it was one of the biggest events or incidents that occurred uh, in the generation of my father. ま、um, it was uh, the film depicts a period of the so called Red Parch, um, the United States, um, uh, and uh, the United States purged the communist uh, the people in the Communist Party uh, in the post war Japan. And the people in the Communist Party, they tried to go against such uh, brutal acts. And uh, there were lots of incidents of uh, violent um, fights between the Communist Party, the people of the Communist Party, and uh, the one who tried to control such, um, um, resistance, uh, such resistant movements from uh, the below. And uh, these incidents occurred uh, throughout the periods of my father, my grandfather, my father, and myself. ま、これで分かんないように私は政治家が描いたというよりも私自身が知っている家族、祖父、父、私、この私が知っている限りの歴史の中で実は日本の在り方、日本のありよう、どのように日本が変貌していったのか、それを私なりに追求しようとしたの
a, a controversial article about socialism, uh, but the Japanese government banned uh, his article because uh, they thought it's um, uh, kind of a treason going against the empire system. After that, uh, Kita went to China in order to particip participate in the revolution in China. When the revolution in China failed, uh, Kita went back to Japan. He wrote another book, a thick book, um, in which he um, proposed to change the Japanese political system. ま、uh, the book was once again banned by the Japanese government. Um, but this book uh, that he, uh, in which uh, Kita proposed a transformation of Japan, transformation of the uh, national po uh, policy of Japan, um, it became some kind of a Bible of the young intellectuals and young military officers. ま、Kita was a unique um, advocate of socialism. Um, he was thinking about a revolution, but uh, at the current uh, situation of Japan in the 1930s, it was he thought it was it, it would be impossible to um, um, have a successful revolution. What they thought was to um, have the emperor himself to his side. <laughs> まずし身分から軍事になって諸行になった若い将校たちの間に大変な支持を受けてそして当時日本の社会が堕落している uh, so his idea to, to start a revolution in the name of the emperor uh, was very impactful to the young uh, militarist officers and very influenced by uh, such a thought by Kita uh, young officers. They um, uh, started a coup d'etat, which is known as uh, 226 or February 26 incidents um, in Japan in 1936. Well, and uh, I'm not saying anything about how, uh, what's going to happen after uh, this incident occurred. Uh, you are going to see what's going to happen after this incident. Lastly, um, I want to say this. Um, only one year after this incident, uh, February 26th incident, uh, Japan declared a war against China in 1937. Then, four years later, uh, Japan started the Pacific War, the war against the United States in 1941.
And the Pacific War continued for four years. で私が12歳、中学生1年の夏に、私の生まれた町は大空襲で全滅します。And when I was 12,、uh, my hometown was attacked by the、uh, US bombers and、uh, devastated by the night raid. もちろん私の生まれた家も焼かれ、一家離散して、たろじて、命を助かったということを経験しております。My house was on fire and I ran around and my family was separated, was separated、uh, but I survived、uh, in such a night way. まあそういう意味では日本の近代、日本が近代国家になってからの歴史というのを皆さんご存知かもしれませんが、私は私自身が知っている歴史、私の体が知っている歴史、それを描こうとしたのが今日の作品です。In that sense, my body, myself, experienced、uh, this modern history of Japan. And、uh, what I wanted to describe or depict in this film was my personal experiences of、uh, modern history of Japan. ありがとうございます。Thank you very much. え。女優の岡田真理子でございます。マイネームズ、マリコ・オカラ、アメナ・アクチュス。あの、私たちが作った映画の中で、今日上映されるこの映画だけ、私が出演しておりません。Among the films that we made together, I'm not in this film. This is the only film that I'm not in. その理由を2つばかりあるんで申し上げたいと思います。There are, there are, there are two reasons for that. 一つは、このシナリオが私の手元に来ましたときに、私のやるべき役は、主人公の北一期の妻の役しかありませんでした。Um, when、uh, the screenplay、uh, came to me,、um, I read it and I thought、uh, there's only one Role that I can do, which is the wife of Kitaiki. でもこの役をもし私が演じたとすれば私の個性が強すぎて、えー、吉田の作りたい作品にならないんではないかと思ったからです。I thought if I had, if I played this role,、um, Probably、uh, my personality or、um, persona is too strong that、um, the film that Yoshida, Mr. Yoshida would make would be、um, a different one that he initially、um, had thought. But I like this project, this film, so much that I decided to become a producer of this film. もう一つの理由は、この映画を制作する3ヶ月前に、吉田は胃を切除するという大手術をいたしております。Only two months before、uh, they went into the production of this film, Mr. Yoshida、uh, went, into, uh, went through a serious, very serious surgery of his stomach.、Uh, I'm talking about the second reason、uh, why I, I'm not, I was not in this one. その時、大手術をする時、私は、えー、東京の日比谷にある大きな劇場に出演しておりました。手術の日、私は徹夜をして彼を見守りそして翌日から午前中病院へ寄って午後からは舞台の公演1日2回をこなしてそれが終わると病室へ駆けつける生活が2週間ほど続きました。Um, when Yoshi,、uh, Mr. Yoshida went through that surgery.、Um, so, 
on the day of the surgery, I didn't sleep at all. And then I went to the theater and played the role twice a day. And for two weeks, um, uh, the commute between the Hill Hospital and the theater continued. え、彼の体を守っていかなければならない。え、3 addition to being an actress, I am Yoshida's wife. So I was thinking seriously about his health, and I devoted myself for the, uh, the recovery of Mr. Yoshida. Um, and uh, the production would begin in just three months, so I did my best. Even though the film, um, the story of the film is set in uh, the midsummer. Um, uh, the actual shooting was done in a midwinter in Kyoto. I commuted to Kyoto from Tokyo a number of times, and uh, the day of the uh, film's release finally came. 本当に私は制作者として素晴らしい映画だと思いました。As a producer, I thought this is a wonderful film. アメリカ映画とは違う。そして日本の黒沢明の映画とも違う。40を過ぎたばっかりの若い監督の作ったこの映画。どうぞゆっくり見てやってください。This is a different film from those Hollywood films. This is a different film from those made by film uh, directors like Akira Kurosawa. This film was made by a young director in his 40s. Please enjoy this film. Thank you very much.